good evening, Spire lovers. Let's do some spiring. Oh, oh, that's nice. That's just a nice run. Nothing to worry about there. Green and red is the classic combination. Green and red and money is a desirable combination. And cursed. Cursed is work well. Is either rare and no uncommon and common cards are a bit bland. They're still lovely. They still work just fine. If I can get a feel of no pain and some shivs, that would be great. I see three elites. Who's at the top waiting? Guardian. I think I can stop Guardian. Without too much hassle. Those are both really handy. Should I really be taking curses? Which means I get- Ooh! I do like a good molten egg. I mean, it's not like it's a, um, a toxic egg, but it ain't bad. Let's see what I can do here. Hit you with one of these. Battle trance. Hit you with some more of these. I have no potions. I have probably no hope. hope after all. I just need a few more good turns like that. The battle trans plus the backflip are actually working. Uh, let's see, that's 9 and 12. Darn it. Is it possible? Is it even possible? Whoops. and a strike and another strike. That's more like it. 21 and vulnerable. And all of these cards, yes. That'll do it. Letter opener sounds like great fun. Dagger throw sounds like a really good addition. It's like the silent headbutt, a card that you just love to have. So let's go with heavy blades so I can get some silly numbers. Why, yes, those numbers are silly. Good. 
Oh, that's what I'm talking about. That is a really good relic. Horncleat is desirable. Bag of marbles. Ooh, a dark embrace sounds like a lot of fun. I don't have anything that exhausts, but dark embrace is just so useful. Even if I haven't got any exhausted things yet, I'll undoubtedly get some. Unseizing top sounds like a lot of fun. Okay, so yeah, I can take... I could take that. I could take that. That would be an interesting choice, if not a particularly powerful one. Uh, I am guaranteed to get enough curses anyway. So let's get, yeah, let's get rid of this. Let's take this, and then that, and that. And I'm gonna take a gamble's brew so that I can maybe squeeze myself out of a bind. I can't smith at rest sites, but I do have extra energy. So between that, I should be okay. <coughs> blood for blood, um, am I gonna lose health? It is upgraded. Which means it's... It's interesting, even if it isn't good. I very much doubt it's going to be good. Oh, you're dead. Heavy Blade is proving to be quite sufficient. There's... Oh, let's go with Spot Weakness. Yes, that's alright. That is quite good enough. That's a good start as well. That's so much stupid damage. Yes, let's kill Thorn with more health. <coughs> oh yes, Regret will take the do damage to me. Well, that's another another little bit of synergy I can get. I don't really want to have synergies that are silly. I want synergies that make sense. Ah, oh, nuts. Really? So be it. Me, I'll take it. Hey, upgraded body slam is really good. Turn two, that's guaranteed 14 damage if I draw it. Let's take it. Shopman. You have arrived at an interesting time. Yes, let's have an upgrade to Hemoglenesis. That's funny. That's, a, that's an amusing card to take. Deflect is also an amusing card to take. Strange Spoon isn't actually very amusing at all because I like exhausting things and I would rather not not exhaust things. However, Block Potion is pretty reliable against the What's-His-Face and Bandage Up is... It's a card that exhausts and it's a skill and I guess that's fine. That's those are all positive traits. My current loadout looks is making those traits look beneficial. And that is gorgeous. Shattering your bones right away. You don't have enough bones. I'm gonna make you have less if I can at all help it. Fewer. Fewer bones, not less bones. E the English language, please. Have you considered speaking the English language like you're not a commoner?
have you considered not engaging in class warfare? I had, but decided that it was silly. That's, no, that's not good. That's sad. so annoying. Okay, how do I make this thing die without taking the damage? It's a sad, sad situation. Maybe not exhausting all my defense would be a good start. That's interesting. So I can get to that turn pretty reliably. And this deck is just just nice, it's simple. Straightforward, hits things, they die. I just need to defend against the odd attack. That's no good. I wanted to use those. How do I use those properly? I have an idea. I use them this turn get rid of stuff I don't want. Then I have my really big body slam. <coughs> Defending here is easy. I could have checked what I was going to draw, but I didn't. I don't have to because I can beat this guy up. And it's not even hard. Nine incoming. Spot weakness, backflip. Defend. Defend. And I can endless agony a couple of times. damage from that. That's fine. As long as I didn't exhaust Heavy Blade, I win. Wound... 
wounds or nah I don't need wounds they don't add anything to the deck I mean I'm exhausting cards yes but I'm course I'm exhausting cards that do things not cards that don't do things why would I exhaust cards that don't do things that seems silly I guess I'm going to two shops which means I get to be picky at the first one that's all right I have two charges of Omomori left, three curses to go. Sounds good. is card draw and card draw is generally good in flame is strength and I've already got plenty of that these are the birds the birds are bad I do not like the birds they make me sad which of you wants to die a death day I think we go for the front one don't have any area attacks. Area attacks are one of the things that could be considered useful against birds. That dark embrace that costs two is just going to make me sad every time I look at it. There's an area attack. 11 to all enemies. The thing is, Shrug it off is better than an upgraded cleave. Number 5 hand. If I take that, I can take some interesting powers. If I take ornamental fan, I can defend myself in an interesting way. <laughs> Dagger spray is really strong. Okay, I wasn't picky. I just took what I thought was cool. And now there's going to be a membership card on the next shop. Or something equally annoying. <coughs> Guess what? Die. Oh, those are all good. Blade Dance is really strong here, but Pommel Strike upgrade in two cards? That's just pleasant. Okay, I can afford to not take a Preserved Insect. That's alright. I don't need that. The Whirlwind is a bit sad, though, and the fact that they're only off that the best card I can buy is a Power Through. Oh, if only I could afford the Whirlwind. You know what, I'm going to buy the Fear Potion because there's a chance it will let me get through an Elite that I wouldn't otherwise be able to get through. The Skill Potion would also have been a valuable choice, a valid choice, but I do not believe it would have been the correct choice. In this situ situation, I have some of the tools required to kill the back line slaver. I see no reason not to try doing that. Also, I have energy. That's also useful. Combust makes something free. Seven in. I can make that go away with speed potion.
Oh, I could have attacked. I keep forgetting about unceasing top. It works sometimes. But it's not like I'm defect. Okay, uh, that's a good card to play with on Seizing Top. Where's my... Did I take an unupgraded outmaneuver? Okay. Sever Soul can do things on occasion. Why not? It's sometimes the attack that can be played. These campfires are worthless to me. I wish I didn't have to go through them. Miss a curse again. Always bet on the owner. This is a situation where I kill everything with knives. Where's my blue candle? Somebody died. They shouldn't have done that. Tori. Not the most useful thing I've ever seen. Upgraded feed isn't actually going to get me points. Dodge and roll is the only one I don't have. Sounds good. You showing up in this room was just a bad choice on your part. You should have, you know, not. Then you might have been able to not die. Oh yes, that Tori. It isn't much, but it's there. And get rid of the curse. I doubt nothing today. Uh, I could take poison stab. It's not really conducive to the deck that I'm trying to make, though. <coughs> Will it get in the way if I take it? Oh, probably. It's fine, you just have to give me a card that will do the opposite. Backstab is pretty conducive to the deck I'm trying to make, but Piercing Whale is such a reliable defensive card, I can't help but take it. Nobody's attacking. That's unfortunate. Hang on. I should have played those in the other order. The other way around, I should have played them. which is 36. Can't use it to instantly kill the orb. The orb is the more dangerous enemy, but it is what it is. That was a def that was definitely a way to die. Oh, I like a bit of rage. Yes, Warcry is good, but the rage was upgraded. Yeah. Well, that's interesting. Let's use this then. I'm gonna keep those for some shenanigans later. Oh boy, when I say shenanigans, I mean shenanigans. Silly, I, silly, silly champ. Silly, silly champ. You don't have what it takes. I also don't have what it takes. I have been made frail. I 
that is. It's actually a death sentence. Violent now. Wasn't violent enough. must become so violent that he doesn't survive. Well, I don't think it can happen. I think I'm doomed by the way. That turn was this turn, but it wasn't. Oh dear. How do I make this work? No, this is the alternative where I still don't have enough defense. Dang. I agree. I agree with myself from earlier. This is not possible.
have a solution. It wasn't a solution after all. The idea was to not draw rage, but I kept playing cards. And now I'm here. That's fun. That's quite fun. That's quite amusing. And now the sound's gone off. It's fine. I drink this still. Play this still. I sever soul instead of playing backflip. I play both of these. I don't play the bandage up because it's silly. And now I have just drawn rage anyway. What did I think I was going to accomplish, I wonder? Playing more cards lets me get closer to defensive cards and also aggressive cards. I want to do both of those things because the champ is going to do nasties to me on turn 3. And I would much rather the champ did not do nasties to me on any turn. Heavy blade becomes very powerful. thought I've had in a good time. So I can actually upgrade these and it's good. Although I think I'm increasingly tempted not to. Spot weakness is only a difference of one strength. It might add up, but it might not.
Well, that's a shame. So I have to do that on turn two if I want to get even close. And I do want to get close. I want to get so close that I'm there. Oh yeah, I remember the strategy. I remember the lead strat. We Blessing of the Forge here. Piercing Whale defend. Sever Soul. Double Endless Agony. Bandage up. A spot weakness. And now let's drink this. So I'm kind of deeper than I would be normally. Can I use that? We shall see. I have extra energy here. But the problem is... I'm still not deep enough to have any blade hit the champ this early. How deep can I go without playing the potion? Results are not guaranteed, apparently. What comes next? Ah, oh, nothing that could defend me. Okay. I think it isn't possible. I'm calling it. I'm calling it now. I, I, I think I called it before that it isn't possible to to champ the champ. The champ is a little bit, bit, bit too champ for me, perhaps. That makes no difference other than the fact that I keep my uh, thing for later. That's all right though. That could be. That could come in handy. What comes next in the deck? Combust, defend, strike, quick slash. That's sad. It's tremendously sad. Hmm. Well, whatever. Impossible. Yeah, you say that. You can't even take me out by hitting me. What kind of champ are you?
Okay. Give her one extra strength. Why not? I need strength to get past the fact that I sadly didn't get... Oh, there's another doubt as well. Oh, brilliant. Let's turn the music back on. There was no... There was no champ win for me. How utterly this this depressing. Deku and Donu. If I had taken rares, would I have been able to do it? If I'd taken even one rare, like that corruption at the shop. Hmm. It doesn't bear thinking about. The trick is just to do your best with what you have and remember that you have on ZZ Top. Well-laid plans are really potent, but not in this deck. Two normalities, that's pretty damn cool. Uh, if I can go to two shops... I can go to two shops. say no to any of those. There we are. That was the fate that he had coming to him. Oh. 
That's not good. The Malty screwed me. Can we not have that happen? I need to get rid of the carnage and the yeah, and then I get the backflip and that lets me play. Everything lets me play everything. Oh, that's where the energy came from, the outmaneuver. It's like, why is Ironclad got energy? Because Ironclad is also silent. Of course. How could I have been so foolish? Can I not have to deal with normality, please, now? Thank you very much. Perfect <laughs> strike piercing whale. Exist. How am I for curses? Four. What are they? Yeah, I doubt. But there's a treasure chest, I'm gonna get a different one. And I'm gonna get another different one against the final boss. Fantastic things. Fantastic, fantastic, fantastic. 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 And fantastic. Oh, and... I should not have bought those. What I should have done is get rid of the doubt. Let's try this again. Doubtless, you thought I'd forgotten about my doubt. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Watch me, watch me go through this shop for a th shop for a third time. <laughs> oh, that wasn't even the shop I was supposed to go in. What are you selling? I could not care less. 
with you on Nemesis. My Nemesis, I think. To specify that. You're a horrible creature that I wish wasn't alive. Oh, my wish was granted. Lost. That's fourteen times eight, that's not nothing. The only way I can defend this with that attack potion. That's not happening, is it? Oh, wow! That's incredibly unfortunate. the whirlwind. It's not useful. It's not real. My energy is what's real. And I have that thing. That's pretty epic. <coughs> you know what else is epic? Heavy blade to the face. Dagger throw getting rid of a normality is pretty epic too. 
any instance where Clash does something like that is pretty epic. The em oh my goodness, the endless agony is showing up and being absolute Chad cards. Yeah. No. So that could have been 1552. It could even have been 16. No, that could have been that could have been 1642. But for the normality and the champ. Oh well. It is what it is. We'll do better tomorrow as always.